got help in the player 3 slot. Can he pass me? I guess not. Coming to join the commentator, we've got Absol. Alright, let's talk about this boss, the ultimate spacey battle. We've got the rivalry. We've got Daga on the box and Falco on the top deck. Falco should be realistic when we uh, win this matchup. Like, 50 40. With his speed and. Not even. Uh, Falco, uh, Fox is faster than Falco, but Falco just has uh, like longer moves his forward smash is longer. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And his down is got like a But uh, we have Daga taking the stock. So. Good. Uh, they'll play on FD. It's kind of sketchy because if the Falco knows how to shine counter with Killer, he'll win. Vice versa, if the Fox can chain grab. Or just chase, tech chase it. So it's kind of even, honestly. Have you played really that much to know like, the good stages with these two? Not in the least bit. No? Alright. So the good stages that they'll probably pick after, if uh, Falco wins, the box should probably. Well, honestly, it's even for both. Usually Yoshi Story, Battlefield, Greenland. Or FD are the best picks, my friend. Right. And then Pokemon Stadium is a little bit easier for uh, a certain character. I won't say because they're next to me. But, we were, okay, we're getting some combos here. Uh, the laser game. He's finally short hop laser. Attack. You usually don't want to get up attack too much, but honestly, if you don't read it, it's a good choice. Perfect. I'm gonna follow up. Not looking good to get help right now. Ah, uh, yeah. He need to get. There we go. Even up with the two stops to please. Falcon and Fox have two different styles of playing in terms of getting in on each other. Mm -hmm. The Fox, uh, the Fox can get in honestly easier than the Falco. It's just the Falco can keep it going forever in like the combo game. Mm -hmm. That's just my opinion on it. So if you get in with Falco, and you can't combo, you're more than likely screwed when you get to decent box. So let's get down here, then uh, punish it. That's one thing I got working on is uh, doing aerials from ledge, really. Mm. Okay, perfect. No punish for doing that. So another thing, I'm starting to punish more as I go up. You can stop it. Mm. But you just got no ledge again. Right? Or just stay calm. Are you gonna play Smash 4? Or did you just pay yeah. for Dan? You are playing Smash 4? Yeah, cool. Is uh, Brooke playing it also? Yeah. So we have yep. quite a bit of people actually. Yeah. Which is a good turnout for that. I wish Melee had a little bit more. Did we lose? We lost the tie. Free. Oh. Free no, he's over there. Oh. Very back there playing Smash 4 by himself. Oh, okay. He's trying to play. He needs to Yeah. Definitely. I know he's playing against a Dark Pit player. Oh, okay. Yeah, he's really good. Like, uh, I was trying to make a highlight video with him. Um, a few tournaments ago, that he almost came back against the number two player at the game, mm. uh, which is a King DVD player. We almost beat him by going back. Uh, whatever, it's two stocks, right? Two Smash Four competitive. Do you know that? No, I don't know. I think two stock come back. He was down. He was last stock, and I knew he was a high percentage. So coming back after that. It's pretty good with Dark Pit. <laughs> so you don't see that. I know, like, Brawl, it was alright. <laughs> nice! Oh, Come back with the Falco. I like that. Falco. <laughs> Just like what I was talking about, how the Falco can put a long time to it. Real mental game, too, in this space. Perfect combo game right there. The down air hit that was trying to spend another pillar. Hmm. Uh, 
two rounds now for Coke? <laughs> oh, one round he won. This one? is the second round, yeah. Oh, okay. No, I'm thinking I'm trying to eat this chip before I play. My blood sugar is absolutely gone right now. So, yeah. They wouldn't let us get food from, uh... What is the place? Starbucks over there? Oh, uh, why not? Because Maya had my card. I guess didn't trust her. <laughs> yeah. I feel like every tournament's a grind with me. Like, I used to go to New York City, mm -hmm. and... When I went out to go at like 4 in the morning, so I had no food or breakfast. Oh no. And I survived the whole day, I'm like a monster that they give us. That's crazy. I think in general, gaming uh, kind of makes people forget the idea of like eating and stuff mm -hmm. like that. So you don't feel it until like you actually eat these games or something like yep. that. And then you're like, holy crap, my hands are shaking. <laughs> yeah, you hit the wall. I'm terrible with that, so. I need to eat without having shit. Especially after a match when they drown. Mm -hmm. We should get. Alright, there we go. First. We didn't grab that ledge. We probably could have made it. But it's still even in terms of like the matchup. Yeah, indeed. We just need to it's get in. There you go. Those punch. I knew. Like when he's falling like the H, that's punished it. Side B, that's right. But oh, perfect laser, we just didn't hit. Nice. Should have it. Yep. Alright, I'm almost done with the chip. Got it in my Ah. Good to read by Doritos making a nacho flavor chip. I want them to sponsor us. Nacho cheese. Oh, right. They're so good. But that was probably the best decision they made. Nacho cheese flavor? Yeah. Then they just seen the whole Taco Bell. Oh, yeah. Make the best? Yeah. Look, that it's not so... Okay. I don't even... I don't get them at all. Oh, she sucks. It pains me whenever I see a do like that. Another Falco made the house. <laughs> Like, it's not that side B's aren't good for Falco. Box definitely has a better side B. It's just that you need to know how to use it. But she does have perfect. I would say he slows it down. So he, like, he times it perfectly. So if I'm covering it, he'll get right after I'm Oh, what the? SD by the Fancy. Oh, we can keep it up here. Oh, perfect. Really good shine game. He's very good at watch so shining. Like, I need to. I can do it against like mid tier players. That are like RA at the game. I can wait shine them and do all sorts of shit. So, could you explain to our viewers exactly what a buddy is? So, alright, so you know, you see how he's like, oh, alright, the box takes the second game. So, you know how, like, when you scoot across the ground and they don't jump, they're sliding? Yeah. That's technically, that's a wave dash. Um, and it affects you properly after it. During it, you can actually do a uh, shine, which is what you see. Right. And then you jump cancel it. To get out of the shine, you jump cancel. Mm -hmm. So that means you just jump. Um, there's a certain frame, it could be first. It basically within like five frames, in my opinion. And that's a wave shine. Okay. And it's beneficial if you watch him when he does, he'll scoot right under him. Position him just perfectly so he gets the shine. And it leads into a combo. And the fox can't tech, then it's more than likely like a rack on the like 80% damage. Talking about 80% damage, he's already passed up. See, that's where the side to be punished is perfect. Just needs to watch out for that. And that was good by Daga by punishing the side B, so he's catching out a little bit more, but he's gonna do it. Kinda sucks, but. Perfect. Alright, so he went for the jab up smash. That's the signature box. So Falco. If you're a Falco, if you're a true Falco main, such as Kelp here and myself, you're not going to get too much wrap up into that. Not really. Oh, you want to live on the legacy of Falco always being Falco. Hmm. There's never a Star Falco game. Yeah, it's always Star Fox, why can't we be Star Falco? <laughs> He's honestly my favorite play, like, Fox is cool, but then just Falco is just this is sarcastic one. Oh, um, no. He could. Yeah, he could. He's a good combo. Doesn't help. He's on his map too. Found in Dreams, believe it or not, he's got the best map. And he can't stop like that. 
Though, if you got that, that would have been a perfect start. Good down air. Oh, nice shine stall. That's honestly like one of the few times I would ever shine stall, and that was a perfect down air. One thing I, I catch myself doing in other players, don't do fancy shoot. Just go to the ledge as fast as you can. Mm -hmm. And grab it. I do recognize what you guys are saying about the flag and the monitor. Yeah. And on the recording, I'll do that. I'm gonna review it after this. I have for melee time, I'm gonna review it and make sure everything's fine. Since it's not that thing to do melee. But, as you see, help is keeping it up and he just needs to start doing something. That was perfect. Good opportunity to mess up on the air. Dash attack. You don't want to dash attack. Definitely not against Falco as much. You can, but it's not gonna do much for you. He's just looking good for Fox, he's already down on this spot. And like what I said, the Falco can just go in on it. That's like the idea oh, of what Falco is. Yeah, he held that combo too. He's so. gonna be uh, down to last stock. This is a perfect opportunity, just like after the first map, for a couple of tickets. Alright, so it's 2 1 Doggets. Yep. I bet. That helps me go back to that. Yep. Good read, buddy. That's his best map. I hate FOD, but that's because my game's different from Kel's. In terms of I laser to get into my combos a little bit more, he wave shines. Once I learn how to wave shine, FOD may be one of his maps. That was very. That was an excellent combo. Right on the edge, and then just knock him back down. I love seeing Falco combos, but I never like get too hyped about him because uh, he has his stuff. But I just don't get too hyped about it because I play the game all the time, so I expect this to happen. I was like, alright, good job that you did it. I was so freaked out with some commentary with. That's why I can never be perfect. He has perfect. Kelp has like perfect shield. Like, I shield too much. He shields perfectly. To extend his combo game. Like, I can't start. I have an insane combo game, like me, but then I can't do it by shield. Mm, right, right. You have to, like, just keep yourself open. Mm -hmm. yeah, yeah, yeah. Get them, like, overly aggressive and out as much. But this is looking good for Kelp, and especially since it's FOD. Now, I don't know if you knew this, um, they can't cho cho yeah, choose FD again as a counterfeit. Because both of them I've already won on it. Oh, okay. So we won't see any more FD. So right now it looks to me in Falcon's favor if uh Kelp if Dreamland is struck, he's really good on it. But then Daga can do the same thing with grab it or change at it. So either or it's gonna be a crazy lab game five if it goes so It looks like in May. Yeah, you, just need, you, need to, you just need to know to shine even if it's off screen. He's gonna do that. Good down air, even though it didn't go off stage, it's still damage. That's all that matters. Perfect nair. Not perfect nair, you got hit by the fire, but it's still good. You're, you're always gonna get hit with the fire. And he just needed a forward smash, that was looking oh, nice. Good shot. So, game five. So, FOD and FD are out of the question. So, it's the Yoshi Battlefield and Pokemon Stadium. Now, I mean, this is the stage I was talking about that's actually at this order. Or not. Right. That's what was my experience anyways, and you're in this spot. So no, I'm not up and down against playing any other stage, I just know that this stage is one of my favorites. Not actually, actually this is probably my third. You just need to down air, down smash anything. Uh, I probably would have down smashed. But I know Dave can't attack yet. Eventually he will, if we start down smash. And cause him to a ball. <laughs> nice, perfect. So, did you see that forward smash? How it was tip of his boot, literally like the toe. That's that's the Falco forward smash I was talking about. Fox doesn't have that ability. Um, like, we did spot that this is like Like Dave and I have. And that was that we both forward smash at the same time, but mine would hit first. Right. It's just longer, it's just what we hit. But I don't know if you saw that um, when uh, 
I got forward smash Kelly just mm -hmm. now. Yep. So that was probably almost the extent of his forward smash. Mm -hmm. Honestly, that's just in his boot. Not long. It's so stubby. Yeah. That's why I know him very good. <laughs> Two pixels. Yeah. I don't even know how they measure this stuff. Again. Nice down tilt should kill. Yes. Helps me grab a little bit. Warm up his thumbs. So should get shine. Yes. Keep it going. Perfect pillaring. I like his pillaring. Eventually, he needs to stop. Cause it just left, he just got so much more, drop that, down it. Oh, okay, good opportunity, you just need to grab a ledge. Oh, roll! He would've won, he would've had that, the one, two, one, two, one, two, one. Three, do you know about rolling, um, from ledge, what it does for you? Oh, okay, uh, two, two, right, uh, eight, three, four, 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 and there's also, so if you're past 100, especially if you're past 100, you'll roll slower. Mm. And when you roll on to a uh, stage from being on ledge, and this is like in that case how Fox is recovered, right. um, they would actually, they call it holograph hooks. They're holograms. Oh. And, well, that, but you also, um, the opponent can't grab the ledge for whatever reason. It's like still an instance of the uh, animation or the character. The animation of the character or like instance of the character is still on the ledge. So it's like still being hot even though you're off of it. Clearly. It's a weird mechanic into here, but it plays to an advantage. Right, you can present other people from grabbing and Hurt. Grab ledge, grab ledge, grab ledge. Back here, back here! Get off, get off, get off, get off. Good shit. Nice. Perfect win by health. 